Hi, this is George Cow, and here's my a dog buddy. Say hi, buddy. <laughs> anyway, there's a psychologist and behavioral economist uh, named Dan Ariely. You may have seen one of more of his TED Talks before. Uh, he talks about this study where there are a couple of groups of people, one of whom is, are, are given these instructions to build some origami, and the other group is just evaluating them. Okay, so the one, the group that was given the instructions to build origami, they were actually given instructions to build pretty ugly origami. So they spent some time working on it. Finally, they built it. And what's interesting is that the, they measured how much, they've measured through pricing, how much um, the, the builders of the origami felt uh, the origami was valuable versus the evaluators who also had to put a price on it. And consistently, um, it was something like um, uh, the builders felt the origami was worth 50% more than the evaluators did. Now, what's even more astonishing is that, um, yeah, yeah. Uh, what's even more astonishing is that the, there was a third group which uh, was given uh, origami paper, but were not given any instructions to build origami. They were just said, "Just go ahead and build something." And those people who had to figure it out valued their origami even more than the first group that had instructions. So the ones that valued the most were the people who didn't have instructions, had to figure it out on their own, and then the people who had instructions who built it, and then the evaluators just who didn't have any involvement in the project valued the things the least. This is important for all of us who are content creators. If you are a writer, you, maybe you write blog posts, maybe you work on a book, maybe you make videos like I do, maybe you make podcast episodes, maybe you just simply post on social media, and you have to know that because you were involved in your own content building, you figured out, and this is true also for uh, modalities. You know, maybe you went to school for a particular modality, uh, and so you spent years studying it, and so therefore you value it so much more than just someone who didn't go to school on it. See, that's why you're like, this is so important. Why don't other people get it? Well, because you went to years of study on this stuff, right? Um, or, or maybe you figured out a modality yourself. You figured out how to solve a particular problem. And you think, this is the greatest thing in the world. I figured it out. Well, others didn't figure it out. So they didn't have the same kind of energetic investment that you did. So we have to, as content creators, we have to be willing to put our things out into the world and see what it is how it's evaluated by more people than just our own selves because we will have um, uh, what's called the, uh, I'll call it the ugly origami syndrome. We'll have this idea that just because we built it, we don't even realize it. This is, the for, this is the eternal illusion of the content creator. So again, the solution is to keep sharing with the world so that we can keep honing our intuition for, ah, this is what not just I think it's cool, but other people think it's cool too. Other people think it's helpful or entertaining as well. So I hope this is helpful. Remember that the illusion of the content creator will always be with us. Will always, every human being who creates content will always have this illusion. So the solution is to keep sharing and observing what comes back and then modifying our content creation accordingly. You'll hone your intuition for what seems to be objectively good, not just what is good to you only. Hope that's helpful. Until the next video, be well.